The new musical Halftime is based on the true story of 10 senior citizens who auditioned to dance at halftime for a major basketball team. Directed by Jerry Mitchell and featuring a bevy of familiar names, including Lilius White, Georgia Engel, Donna McKechnie, and Andre DeShields, this feel-good show is playing New Jersey's Paper Mill Playhouse. See the seniors bust a move in rehearsal. It's based on a documentary called Gotta Dance, and uh, it's about this uh, group of senior dancers who perform at halftime at a basketball game, but they perform hip-hop. What I love about the show is what hip-hop means, how it started, how it was a, a form of expression, a, a statement of, of saying, I'm here and I stand up and I, I should be counted and I'm important. It's a wonderful platform for all of us elders who are out there who still have some fire and some life in us and we want to show it off. Parents are being their grandparents and their grandkids and it brings everybody together and it, it makes the generation gap disappear. It teaches us not to give up just because things are hard and not and to continue to challenge ourselves and follow our dreams and I think that that's a really important message and something that anybody can really relate to. Learning hip-hop choreography is just as much of an adjustment for the performers of Halftime as it is for the characters they portray. Mitchell and the cast spoke about taking on the fancy footwork. They really are learning hip-hop. Nick Kinkle is teaching them all of the, the authentic hip-hop stuff, and they've really, really, they've met the challenge. The beauty of this show is when we came together, it was very much like the premise, the conceit of the show. We didn't know one another, and that's one of the exciting elements of this show. You are actually experiencing us bonding for the first time. A few aches and pains attached, I will not lie about that. All of us have been doing lots of Epsom salts baths and ice on the knees, but it's, it's worth it. Catch halftime at the Paper Mill Playhouse through July 1st.